Right, hello. This is Let's Play Teresia. Welcome back. This is video 43. And this will teach me to make sure that my microphone is recording before I start talking and moving. Because I just recorded like four minutes of a video with me talking like a dummy and it not actually recording. <laughs> so. All of my funny commentary is gone. I'll have to try and remember it. I don't know if it'll be as funny though. Anyways, when last we left off, um, we just got the hammer and we're gonna go use it now. Smash the rock. And blah blah blah, big boulder, yes we know, thank you. Oh. Wow, that is some mad lag. It's at like... Hold on. Right, sorry about that. My emulator went down to like 5% for some reason. Anyways, a hu this says a huge boulder is blocking up the hallway. We're gonna take the hammer. And we're gonna smash it with a hammer. Swing the hammer. I slam the hammer against the rock. Flag is driving me crazy. After hitting the rock over and over, I finally break it. Smash! We have succeeded in clearing the path. So now we step forward and then we go this way. And we go through the rubble of doom to the door. Door! There's an odd machine sitting near the entrance to this room. I don't think I can get into the room unless I walk over it. You can't walk over this. You will blow up. It will explode your face and you will die. But we got this black curtain a million and ten years ago. Remember when I said, don't forget this curtain, it's vitally important? Yeah. Okay, cover it up. From a safe distance, I toss the curtain on top of it. Explosion! It's a fire and doom. I hear a muffled explosion from underneath the curtain. That thing must have been a landmine. Now I can enter the room. Landmines are fun, kids. As I step into the room, I look around at the shelves. They look like they're all full of ammunition. Ooh. There's something that looks like a landmine on top of the wooden box. It looks like the landmine has been deactivated. We need this for much, much later. When we take this, there's a landmine on top of the box. I decide to take it with me. Meanwhile, I decide that lag totally sucks. Like a thought. There's some ammunition in there, but I can't get to it. Blah, blah, blah. I told there's something else in this room. I noticed a pile of wooden boxes. They all look pretty well built. It must have been for something pretty important. But they're empty now. I could have sworn there was something else in this frickin' room. Maybe I'm wrong. They all look blah, 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 blah. blah. Empty boxes, empty boxes. There's nothing interesting here. I guess the landmine must have been the only thing in this room. This is going to be the video entitled In Which Lag Drives Sarah Up the Frickin' Wall. Now we're gonna go back. Because we have to go back anyways. Because we have to... So actually where I'm going is down to these stairs, down here, because now I have the rock smashy hammer doom thingy, and I can smash the rocks. So I'm going to actually cut this, and I'm going to go back down to these stairs. Be back in a bit. Okay, I just wanted to show you guys really quick, as you can see we're not at the ladders yet, or the, the stairs. But there are these benches that I ignored before, because I couldn't remember if they were important or not. Um, 
they said that there was something shiny on top of the bench. I reached toward the bench. There is an elixir on top of the bench. So just so you know, um, there's an elixir here. And I don't think there's anything else here, but I just wanted you guys to know. Um, under the bench is trapped. <laughs> Uh, but the, I just wanted you guys to know that there's an elixir here if you need them. Be right back again. Alright, so here we are at the stairs and we're gonna go up them. This is a pretty dramatic area. Full of drama. Ooh, full of lag. Alright, it was slightly better, maybe. No, hang on. There we go. This room is well decorated, but its beauty makes the bullet holes and the horrible smell of rotting flesh stand out even more. It's cheerful. The corpse is wearing a soldier's uniform. It's lying face down and its back is covered with blood. The bloody corpse seems to be starting to rot. Touch it. Slowly reach for the corpse. This feels disgusting. I can't find anything. There's another one over bed over here. Of course, the soldier's uniform on the bed. He looks like he died holding his position in this room. I wonder if there was a firefight here. Let's touch that corpse. I reach toward the bed. I don't see anything interesting. I know there's something in this room we have to get. Traces of bullets. The ball, no trace of the bullets. This looks like my main face. My pillow's so dry, I don't know why, but it feels comforting. I know there is something in this freaking room. Towards the bed, I'm gonna get shanked. Yep. Lag, lag. Please reach out, my home great the string. I'm gonna mean I let on the string of screen and Bob de Blanc. I reach for the chair, it feels soft and my hand knocks up a cloud of dust. This chair probably hasn't been used for a long time. Maybe there isn't anything in this room. Flip the switch on the desk light, but the light doesn't turn on, maybe it's broken. Um hmm, hang on. Well, maybe I don't need anything here. So let's go into the next room. I wish I could remember. <laughs> Sorry that my memory is like shite, guys. Crash the rock. You might have to wait until the. You will have to wait until the next video for the dramatic happenings. Ooh, full of drama. Can't go in here yet. Pretty sure it's locked. The lag is gonna make me stab things in the face. The door is magnificent. Yes, it is. This looks like a normal door, but I have a bad feeling about it. You should have a bad feeling about it. It's a bad door. I don't want to try opening it yet because if we do, it'll like spark a huge cutscene and there's like a minute left in the video. So. So let's go down here to this room. This beautiful room is full of corpses. There's nothing. Yes, there's a corpse on the bed. Reach for the dead soldier that's lying on the bed. I think I have to pull him this way. Take the soldier's corpse to the right, maybe not. Hmm. Maybe it's the one leaning against the wall. Blah blah blah, she feels like she's gonna vomit. Maybe it's this one. I reach for the dead soldier that's leaning against the wall. Pull it this way. Behind the corpse, I found something like a glove. Might be useful. I decided to take it with me. And I think that's the only thing in this room. <sighs> I have such shitty memory that sometimes I swear. And white sheets seem out of place. 
Um, yeah, I don't remember, but I think that's all we need. So I'm going to cut this video off here. And um, next time we will go into the Doom Pool Room. And you guys will see why it is full of Doom. Alright, thanks for watching. Bye!